Coming up, Jonathan finds the friendliest hammerhead in the ocean. Welcome to Jonathan Bird's Blue World. It's a beautiful day in the Bahamas, and it's about to get better because I'm meeting up with Coyote Peterson. Hey, man! How are you? Mark Vins and Mario Aldecoa from Brave Wilderness to help with the creation of their new show, Blue Wilderness. We start in Grand Bahama and sail north on a liveaboard dive boat called the Dolphin Dream, one of my favorite boats. Our destination? Tiger Beach, a famous place where tiger sharks interact with divers. Upon arrival, the crew starts chumming. Then we suit up and hit the water. We have tons of sharks. Our team and the guys from Brave Wilderness are having a blast. We're getting lots of great footage. Most importantly, the main attraction has shown up. We have multiple tiger sharks swimming around us. Coyote even gets up close with the tiger. But then things get even more magical with the arrival of a rather special shark, a great hammerhead named Patches. Great hammerheads are usually quite shy. It's extremely unusual for one to get right up to the camera like this. So after the dive, Mark and I ask Captain Jared about her. Jared, tell me about Patches. Tell me the history of this shark. All right, so Patches showed up at Tiger Beach about two seasons ago. Uh, she wasn't too playful when she first came in. She'd hang out around the outside of the dives a lot. But as she got used to the divers and watched the tiger sharks doing their thing, coming in and feeding, she started to slowly make her way in. And once she started getting comfortable with us, she'd let us feed her some pieces of fish. We used to catch fresh fish for her because she was a bit of a picky eater. And then she got more and more comfortable with us and let us get a little bit more hands on with her and pet her. And then once that happened, she pretty much just stuck around. And so she's quite special for us at Tiger Beach because she's the only hammerhead we know that acts like that and stays in that area. So is it a rare experience to get to get up close to a hammerhead like this at Tiger Beach? Most hammerheads, they're quick. They come in, they spend 10 or 15 minutes. They don't really go that close to everyone. They kind of like move through, get their food and get out. But with patches, you'll see that she'll come in play with the diver at the bait crate, then go and spin through all the divers at the dive site and then come back in. So it's quite special the way she interacts with people. With this magnificent shark hanging around the boat, Mark and I know that there's no time to waste. We quickly suit up for another dive to film Patches while she's here. All right, Mark, let's go see if we can find Patches. Hammerhead sharks, let's do it. Yeah. The minute we hit the water, Patches comes right over to investigate us near the surface. She exhibits the classic hammerhead tilted swimming behavior, which has only recently been scientifically studied. It allows the great hammerhead shark to use its tall dorsal fin as a wing to increase lift, reducing swimming effort. Patches passes extremely close to me, but her proximity is in no way aggressive. She's clearly just curious. She's the kind of shark that underwater photographers dream about. Cooperative and friendly, coming super close to the camera, but in no way threatening. Patches just seems to go back and forth between me, cameraman Bill, and Mark.
And sometimes she likes to demonstrate how hammerheads use the mass of their hammer and their incredibly flexible body to turn on a dime like no tiger shark ever could. Patches is my new favorite shark of all time. Eventually, we sink down to the sandy seafloor next to the reef, and Patches follows us like an excited puppy. Soon, our dive master Houston has joined the party with a crate full of fishy snacks. We all gather around, cameras at the ready, to begin filming the shark feed. And Patches isn't about to be left out of the action. She's the only hammerhead I've ever seen that will swim into a feed with a bunch of tiger sharks. She's just as long as the tigers, but nowhere near as girthy and powerful. She sticks up for herself, even pushing one of the tigers away by whacking it in the gills. Nearby, a lemon shark is resting on the bottom, knowing well enough to stay away from a bunch of feeding tiger sharks. Lemons can gulp water to breathe and rest on the bottom. But not patches. Great hammerheads are called obligate ram ventilators. They're one of the few species of sharks that need to keep swimming to ram water down their throats and into their gills. So they keep moving and usually have their jaw open. It looks aggressive, but it's just respiration. She may have to keep moving, but her super shark power is turning. Great hammerheads can turn much tighter and faster than tigers, and even reef sharks, which are far smaller. Turning so tightly, Patches can make twice as many runs at the chum box, so she gets more chances to be fed. and her persistence pays off. Houston doles out some nice, yummy fish. We have three tiger sharks on the dive, and normally even one tiger shark would be amazing. 
but Patches still steals the show. She's the star, and I think she knows it. She just keeps making passes in front of everyone. We aren't going anywhere as long as we have air to breathe. No scuba tank lasts forever, and soon we have to make for the boat. Patches follows us up to the swim step, but we definitely are not afraid, only thrilled. Dude, most cooperative hammerhead shark ever! Is this real life? Did that just happen? Oh, guys, that hammerhead was enormous! And unbelievably friendly. Wow, yeah. what a segment. Jonathan, yeah. thank yeah. you. Good work, man. Dude, nice. Yes, that was awesome. At the end of a long day diving with the world's most awesome hammerhead, I can only wonder if I will ever meet her again. With any luck, Patches will return next season so other divers can get to know her and develop an appreciation for one of the most spectacular shark species in the blue world. Hey everyone, if you want to learn why hammerheads swim at an angle, check out the video we did to explain it. And thanks for watching our latest episode all the way to the end. You're crazy if you don't subscribe. And check out our merch link in the description for some Blue World swag.